guys, welcome back to another vlog. So today is actually a very exciting vlog. I'm doing a little weekend in my life and Alan and I actually have a bunch of things planned for this weekend and so I thought I'd just bring you guys along. It's actually surprisingly warm out today. Like it's 18 degrees. There's the sun. It's a little windy, but I'm out early this morning because I'm actually heading over to Reteich. You guys know I love them. And we're going to go pick up some items to shoot some looks with. But yeah, I just made my way downtown this morning and that is currently what is up. I just thought I'd bring you guys along in this little weekend in my life. Because like I said, Alan and I actually have a lot of things planned. So yeah, let's head to Reteich. Alright, so I just got to Reteich. Uh, I thought I'd show you guys around a little bit and then have you guys pick the pieces with me or like show you the pieces that I'm picking out. So. This is a little outfit of the day. I'm just wearing this oversized YSL shirt and then these leather pants from Zara. So I decided to go with this little Fendi bracelet. So I thought I'd do a cute little detailed shot as well as this Balenciaga bag and then this brown Chanel tote. You guys are gonna love the outfit that I have planned out for this bag, it's so cute. I'm so excited to shoot with these pieces. place in Yorkville. Oh my hair is crazy. But we just picked a little place in Yorkville to eat dinner at. It's already dark. It's only like six o'clock. I don't like this winter in Canada, but here we are. So we just finished dinner. I'm gonna sign off for the night and I'll see you guys in the morning when we are going to be doing some more stuff. So good night. Good morning you guys. So it is currently around 10 a.m. Alan and I are actually just heading to go to the art gallery right now. So I'll let you guys in on the little plan for today. So we're going to the art gallery this morning and then we're gonna come back and do a little bit of schoolwork, probably go to the library. And then we're actually heading to the... <laughs> And then we're actually heading to the aquarium tonight because we were supposed to go for my birthday back in March when everything closed and now we finally are actually getting to go again. So this weekend we're actually kind of being a little bit of tourists in our own city but that is what is up and we are heading to the art gallery now this morning and I will talk to you guys in a bit. She likes chocolate covered strawberries and wine she likes notes that say I love you all the time Roses at your feet Baby girl be mine Baby girl be mine Yeah, yeah Pick up your phone, I need your attention My girl so bad we call her detention I am so glad we moved beyond friendship and your mama like me, look, I squared up with Cupid, told him find me. I saw your love, he shot my heart. I'm losing breath, it's getting dark. I think I might need CPR, baby, won't you tell me, do you love me like I do? Tell me what you're willing to prove, cause I ain't got nothing to lose. It's true that you mean the world to me, yeah. I travel around the globe, but I know that you're the only girl for me. And I gotta let you know that, yeah, baby, yeah. So we just finished up at the art gallery. We were there for about like an hour and a half, two hours. So we're heading to go grab some lunch now and then study for a little bit before we go out to the aquarium tonight. 
All your memories through a broken Telecaster Would you be here in the fall In the long December Pull me closer So we stopped for a little Starbucks Instead of getting two drinks each, what we always do, show them, is we just get a giant one drink and then share it. So we ended up getting a Trenta today, which is 24 ounces. So we both just get 12 ounces and it ends up being cheaper than buying two drinks. So a little life hack. See this town is for the ghosts. studying at the library so we are going to go quickly we make some dinner and then we're heading to the li library oh my gosh I can't talk then we're heading to the aquarium yay baby you could keep me going cuz you've been everywhere let me take up all the love you're showing I need it more than air and you know that I've been suffocating You could be the one to help But my issues are nauseating I don't wanna bring you down but I just wanna be free from the free And feel love for the first time I just wanna love something about me See something to open my eyes Don't wanna be the only oh, one with the house oh, Something to oh. love we were living in my dreams Cause in another world you'll come with me And we'd be out of sight, out of mind Driving windows down with your head in mind Out of sight, out of mind Out of sight, out of mind We just finished at the aquarium. It was awesome. I definitely, we would recommend it, yeah? Yeah, it was great. It was great. We'd never been before, so it was a lot of fun. But I'm gonna sign off for the night. So, good night, guys. Happy Sunday. This morning I just made myself a little cup of mint tea. I wasn't feeling coffee this morning. I got to sleep in because it's Sunday so I didn't really want to have any caffeine or coffee or anything but this week's vlog hasn't been really chatty so I'm just gonna sit down and chat with you guys for a little bit. This weekend was really busy and really fun. Alan and I just like spent the weekend being tourists in our own city but I didn't really get to talk to you guys a whole lot so Honestly, it was just a lot of fun being able to take a little break from school because we have another round of midterms coming up in like a week and a half. So it was nice to just be able to take a break, you know, do some things that are fun, get our minds off of school, like just be able to spend time together. Just because it's been kind of hard with school and stuff, like I'm sure if you guys are in uni or college and you're in a relationship and you don't go to the same school or don't live super close together, you'll understand that kind of like it's hard to just travel and see the person that you're with but it was nice to be able to take the whole weekend and just do these little things that were super fun plus we'd never been to the aquarium and that was so much fun oh my goodness we both love aquariums and we'd never been to the one in toronto for some reason we loved it so we spent the whole evening there um i don't know what my hair is doing right now this is the leftover two day old curls but i came home to a whole bunch of packages last night so i thought it would be fun if we do a little bit of an unboxing the sun is coming right in my window right now because it's just the time of day that it is. I think it's like, 
like 10 30 a.m or something and so because of where the sun is right now there's a whole lot of sun just coming in right there but i got a few packages and then some more over there but i got my sephora sale order in as well as a missouri package and then another little package that i'm going to show you guys the sun is not being my friend right now it is making everything look super washed out and neither is my hair so it is going up <laughs> i don't know that's what's up um i'm wondering how you guys have been with online school and everything i've kind of feel like i've finally settled into a routine and something that i find works for me let me know in the comments how you guys have been finding online school because personally i still hate it but like at least i kind of have found something that works for me and i'm doing okay in online school like it's okay i figured it out kind of first up if you guys follow me on instagram you'll have already seen all about this because i posted it there but i got this little box from vanna and it is a at home facial and honestly the packaging is so cute everything is so cute but it's just like this follow along at home facial it comes with like a whole bunch of all these little um, different face masks and different containers of skincare but it's literally an at-home facial in a box and I honestly loved the concept and when they reached out to me and said that they wanted to send me their box I had to say yes and it, the packaging is everything it's so cute but I also have a coupon code for you guys it's just Vanessa 10 for 10% off if you want to go buy their little at-home facial in a box they are a Canadian company a small local company and, and so I'm glad that I get to support them and share them with you guys. Let's do my little Missouri package next. I actually don't remember what is in this box so this is kind of a surprise and their packaging is always on point like can we just look at how like simple but classy and elegant it is? I love it. Like how cute what? We've got two little bags here. The first one Ooh, necklace oh this is so stunning oh my goodness so it's this little chain necklace I love that I've been actually looking for a necklace just like this so that's gorgeous and then the second bag has two boxes oh cute so it's a matching just like the same chain link bracelet and then in the last box actually not sure if this is a bracelet or a necklace I have a feeling it's a necklace but it's just a multiple chain little necklace here. I'm gonna give you guys a close up. So these are the three little pieces of jewelry that Majuri sent me. So we have the matching chain link bracelet and necklace. And then I believe this is a necklace as well. And it's got like three little separate chains, but their jewelry is such good quality and just always amazing. And they're a Toronto company as well. So I love that. And then last but not least, we got my little box of stuff that I got from the Sephora sale. I didn't go too crazy this year, but like I got a decent amount of stuff that I know never goes on sale and I really have been wanting to purchase and so, you know, with the sale and with coupons and stuff, I I decided to get it and like treat myself a little bit. Sorry for the change in camera angle. I thought it would be better if you could actually see the box that I am unboxing. So first I'm going to show you the things that I actually purchased and then all of the little like extra goodies and stuff that they throw in. So first thing I got to finally try out, I've been wanting to try this for forever, is the Yves Saint Laurent Instant Blur Natural Rosy Glow. So it just comes in this little gold box and then it comes with a little dust bag to keep it in. It just looks like this I'm sorry but like designer packaging is so stunning the next thing I got oh my goodness I've been eyeing this probably for the last year year and a half and I just never picked it up because I never really had a reason to but I finally got it for myself and it's the Dior backstage eye palette they were sold out of the one that I was really really eyeing but I was like you know what it's the sale I like this one as well so I got the warm neutrals color palette and holy it is so stunning oh my goodness I love this so much I am so glad I picked this up so pretty oh my goodness I'm so excited to use this hello how pretty is that and then these warm neutral colors the next thing that I got because a few people had recommended I try these out are the peace out pore strips I know the normal pore strips like the Biore or Bior ones that like you rip off are not good for your pores or your skin at all. But Skincare by Hiram said these are okay. 
So we're, we're gonna try them and see what happens. I also got some new foundation to try. I just got the Becca Ultimate Coverage 24 Hour Foundation. The last thing that I got was this Fenty Beauty Matchstick Trio. So it's highlight, a contour, and a blush. I got it in the, the lightest shade because your girl has fair skin, <laughs> obviously. Okay, this is the first time that I've ever bought anything from Fenty Beauty, and I just gotta say, the packaging on this is stunning. Okay, wow. Oh my gosh, they're magnetic! Look! But yeah, it's just a highlighter stick, a contour stick, and a blush stick. So I'm excited to try those out, and... The packaging is really fun. Oh my goodness, that's so cool. I never knew that. Um, and then some of the little sample things that I got, they just threw in. I got the Too Faced Hangover Face Primer. So it's just a little sample one of those. And then I also got a Glam Glow Super Mud Clearing Treatment, just this little, little guy. And this one I'm actually really excited about because a few people have told me to just purchase it in general So I'm glad that they had it um, as a free gift one. It's the Isle of Paradise self tanning drops So it's just a little tiny one of it But I'm excited to try this out because like I said a few people recommended it to me So if I like it then I can actually purchase it. That is everything that I got from the Sephora sale It might seem like a lot or it might not seem like a lot like I know some people that really went crazy with the Sephora sale but I didn't go too crazy this year, which is good. <laughs> Wanted to just give you guys a close-up of some of these products. So this is the Becca foundation that I got, the Yves Saint Laurent blurring powder, if I can open it with one hand, it just looks. And then the Dior eyeshadow, oh, I'm so excited to use this, if I can open it with one hand too. But look, look at those colors. How stunning, especially the one in the middle. Look at how it's like shimmering already. And then these that are magnetic. Like what the heck? That's so cool. But let's just open one and see what it looks like. Okay, so that is either, so that's the highlight. Just as a little side note, this is my little outfit for the day. Just this misguided tracky set and my Aritzia tank top. But I have one more package left to show you. I came home to this giant box. At first I forgot what I had ordered, but it is actually a shelf for when my Cerise Dawn inventory comes in so I can sort it and organize it. But also a little update on Cerise Dawn. Production has started. She has started. We are moving. She is almost ready. I am so excited. I'm getting more and more excited every day because we are getting so much closer to being able to release it's definitely coming very, very soon. Just keep staying tuned for an official release date. I am hoping for sometime early December, but I'm just gonna have to wait it out and see what happens. Like, these things take time, but I'm so excited. Yeah, you guys are gonna love it. I know it already. Like, you guys are going to love this sweatsuit. I'm so excited. I, that's enough said. I'm gonna stop. Just, I'm just gonna stop. And we are actually gonna build this shelf right now because this giant box needs to get out of my space and I want to build this shelf and just set some of the other little Cerise Dawn things that I have in my office up on it. First things first, we need some music and if you didn't already guess, yes. We are gonna listen to Ariana's new album because I'm obsessed and if you haven't listened to it, go give it a listen, it's amazing. That's all I have to say, it's amazing. So we are gonna listen to some Ariana while I build that thing. Through a broken telecast 
stern Would you be here in the fall In the long December Pull me closer See this town is for the ghosts And I'm buried in the rocks, dear All right, so about an hour and a half later and the shelf is all done. I don't think I'm gonna end up keeping it there. I need to kind of reorganize the space back here and just reorganize this room and kind of figure out the layout that I want because there's still just like random stuff laying around. So we'll reorganize and try and figure out where that shelf is going. But honestly, I just keep getting packages for Cerise Dawn, even if it's just little things like that shelf or like little packaging supplies. And honestly, let me fix the lighting for a second. And honestly, it's just making me so excited for the release and just little things keep coming every single day. And I'm so excited to show everything to you guys because this has been such a long process and it's long overdue. Been working at this now for almost six months. So six months of like actual work not just like conceptual work the conceptual work was like a year before this so this has been like a year and a half in the making and i'm just so excited for you guys to see everything and to release it and it's just like everything is finally falling into place and like things took time and things are still taking time but things are finally coming together and i'm so excited and like school is okay right now like everything just seems kind of good right now. My anxiety has been good. I haven't had, knock on wood, uh, I haven't had any like panic attacks or anything recently. Like I've been able to deal with school and deal with the brand and like see friends and family and see people and everything has just been really good and I'm really happy right now and I just wanted to share that with you guys. But I'm gonna sign out from the vlog. I really hope you enjoyed this little weekend in my life and like our adventures downtown and just all the little updates. But hopefully I will see you guys in the next video and I love you so, so much. Bye.